everybody, Modern Wife here. Uh, today I made seafood chowder and I wanted to share the recipe. Um, it makes it extremely easy and really um, delicious, so let's get started. Now, I've already made it. I thought of making this video after it's already ready, so I'll show you the finished product. Um, it's just simmering now. I'm waiting for my husband to come home. Um, so, let's get started with what you'll need. Um, for four portions, that's what this is. You'll need two cans of clams, uh, just from the grocery store, from the canned food aisle. I think these are like two fifty each, at least in Canada. So we start with um, two of those. You open them up, drain um, the juice out of it, and um, put that in the pot. Then you um, wash about three potatoes. Um, peel them if you wish. Uh, wash them very well and leave the peel on um, if you prefer that. One onion, chop that up, put that in there to simmer with the clam juice. Then you add some Worcestershire, that's how I pronounce it, I know that's wrong. I'm really sorry <laughs> if some of you are British, aka Claire, girl, I'd always tell me how to pronounce this. Um, so you add some Liam Perrins, um, just some thyme from the cupboard. I do so all this to taste now, I mean, if you want the measurements I could uh, look that up for you. And um, black pepper. And as for a bouillon cube, I don't prefer those because they have MSG. Uh, so I just use some kind of um, herbal, salty, um, just some flavoring. Um, this is the brand I like. So you let that simmer in there for 15 minutes with the lids closed to um, till the potatoes soften. To test the potatoes, you just take a fork and mash it on the side. If that is um, soft, then you're ready to go. So bring um, the heat up and you add two cups of milk and uh, one cup of half and half cream. If you prefer it really creamy, I don't. So I use three cups of milk. Uh, then you're going to thicken it. Um, you can use cornstarch or flour. I use cornstarch because uh, my brother's girlfriend is a celiac, so she can't have flour. She um, has a gluten allergy. Then you go ahead and add the clams that you've set aside. And I also add the seafood, uh, frozen seafood mixture mix. I um, have that thawed and ready to go. It just adds more um, texture, more hardiness to the meal. You add that in, and there you go. You can see how thick this is. Oh, it's such a delicious hearty soup. And it really is super easy tastes delicious and it's super easy. It's not the healthiest one um, with all the milk and the cream if you choose to add it, but for once in a while, especially in the winter time, it's a delicious treat. Um, usually at this point I just add um, some spices to taste. I like a lot of pepper. Adds that extra kick. Um, some more thyme if you want. More, um, <coughs> I'll just call it Liam Perrin. And uh, yeah, we're good to go. Basically, that's it, to be honest. You heat that back up again, and, um, mwah. 